Hey there and welcome to episode 15 If I'm just gonna say it. I'm Aaron, still your friendly internet renegade and I have to talk a little bit more about Notre Dame and the aftermath of that because I have to get some stuff off my chest. Here we go! So pretty soon in the aftermath of the whole Notre Dame thing the French president Macron uh, vowed to have it rebuilt within five years and within one and a half days up to a billion dollars was raised to do so. I think the last count I saw was 995 million US dollars. Now aside from all the conspiracy theories that immediately uh, come to mind, I'm not even gonna go into that because there's no proof uh, so I'm, I'm not into suggesting too much stuff but uh, <laughs> the fact that one billion dollars is so easily raised for you know, something silly like rebuilding a church, in my honest opinion, uh, compared to, uh, for instance, how difficult it is to raise such an amount for the important stuff out there, like uh, hungry people, maybe. Furthermore, I also feel it represents like a last desperate attempt to save the old institutions. And that's probably also the reason why most of that money is very old money. <laughs> I guess all I want to say is just that it baffles me how a cause like Notre Dame uh, gathers money so much more easily than, than starving people and, and shit like that. I mean, it says a lot, I guess. Now the fact that the Notre Dame is the third biggest tourist attraction in Paris probably has something to do with the whole thing too, but that doesn't justify, of course, what's happening here. Uh, somebody should start a like a fund, a trust fund to her, and see uh, if they can shame them rich bitches into giving at least another billion dollars uh, to save the hungry people. Just a suggestion. Anyway, I'm gonna keep it at that for now. I'm gonna enjoy this another beautiful day in the Netherlands. I'm on the bike now, by the way. So, uh, until the next episode, love ya. Like, share, and subscribe, and comment. Bye-bye.